What's going down, everybody? Canadian 69 Gamers here, and I'm here with the start to my first Let's Play, which will be of The Godfather 2, uh, numero 2. Um, on my original channel, I did do a Let's Play of the first Godfather, which I regretfully did not finish. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get the chance to because my channel was hacked, and you guys know that story if you saw my first video. So, um, I, I did think before about doing Mafia 2, actually uploaded a video, and then it got taken down by um, a bunch of fags over at, at, at 2K. So, what we're going to be doing is The Godfather 2, which was my kind of backup plan. So, we are going to be doing The Godfather 2. Um, oh, there we are. Oh, wow, well, okay, good, they're already on. Alright, well, uh, I'm a huge fan of the Godfather series. Let's just get into that. And there's an intro here, so let's just watch that, and I'll fill you guys in on the rest of the stuff after the intro. The first person I ever called Godfather was Vito Corleone. I only met him a couple of times. I was just a soldier for the family back then. Times were tough. We were at war. Assassins even gunned down Vito. Sonny, his eldest, fought back while the Don recovered and paid the price. Michael, the youngest brother behind Fredo, took over the reins. He and Tom led a war against the five families. They pulled the strings, and my boss, Aldo Trapani, pulled the trigger. He's Michael's right-hand man now, running the family in New York. These days, opportunity is everywhere. But so are new families, fighting for their share. It took a man like Hyman Roth to get everyone to the table. We're gonna divide up Cuba, get richer than we ever could back in the States. This'll be good for the family, and for me. My name is Dominic. Alright guys, so that was a quick little intro there for The Godfather 2. Um... Alright, so yes, we do customize our character, um, as you can see clearly. Um... You saw the intro there. If for those of you who are fans of the Godfather series, which I am, I'm a diehard fan of, of the series, uh, the Godfather, you know, and uh, then you will enjoy this game. I've been through this game once, and um, I I do enjoy it. I, I you can almost call this a blind let's play. I haven't well not completely blind, but like half blind. It's been a very long time since I've played this game. Uh, very very long time actually. Um, I regretfully, regretfully so, I have not played this game in quite a while, so, um, this, obviously, I'm trying to pick out a thing for my guy to wear, I'm not exactly sure what I should be wearing, but, uh, hopefully I can figure it out in a sec, uh, there we go, that's the kind of shirt, uh, jacket I want, I'm very picky with, when, when it comes to customization in games like this, I'm not extremely customizable, because I'm not, I don't change a lot of things, I just get basic stuff, but I'm very picky on the basic stuff. Um, so. Um. Sorry, <laughs> kind of paused for a second there. I was kind of looking through the options, but uh, but yeah. So this game is um, very very awesome when it comes to the customization phase at the beginning. You can also actually, which is which I find pretty cool, you can customize your guy throughout the game. So not just now, which is pretty awesome if you ask me. Um, straight pattern, definitely tuxedo. I'm I'm going with the whole tuxedo look here uh, for sure. Uh, that shirt looks kind of gay, actually. I think I might change that. The shirt. Oh, damn, it just completely changed the uh, the rest of it. But hold on. Uh, shirt style. Yeah, dr I want to keep the dress element to it. I want to change the change the color. No, the pattern, more or less. Uh, maybe just no pattern. Maybe just a plain a plain shirt. Why not? Why not? This is nothing wrong with going plain really. Alright, uh, dress shoes, of course. I think basic Oxfords are fine. 
Let's go black. Black shoes. Gotta look fancy. If you're in the mob. Um, hand accessories. I, I yeah, let's get these gloves. These are like, honestly, are like hitman gloves. These are fantastic. Uh, there's no point in having a ring because you can't even see them. No point of a wrist. Glove color, black. Excellente. All right, I think we are ready to go actually so let's uh get this game started guys uh, yeah let's overwrite i haven't played this game in a very long time like i said so i might be a bit uh bit a bit rusty but uh we can uh try and get started at this so uh let's let's go bring it here let me see it my age had better be correct i am always accurate about my age May you live to 100, Mr. Roth. Congratulations. Cheers. Do you have Salute. Well, the doctors might disagree, but what do they know? <laughs> These are wonderful things we've achieved in Cuba. This government knows how to help business to encourage it. The hotels here are bigger and swankier than any of the rug joints we put up in Vegas. Not all the hotels. <laughs> Michael Corleone's accepted, of course. But the point I'm making is this, that now we have what we have always needed, real partnership with a government. Salute. Cheers. Salute. And at the time of my retirement, I turn over all my interests in the Cuba operation to you, my partners, to the Corleone family and all of Trapani, the Hotel Capri. Grazie. The Nationale will go to Rico Granados, and the Sevilla Biltmore to Samuel Mangano, here with us all the way from Sicily. The rest of you will also share in handling my non-casino operations. Gentlemen, rebels and petty criminals are Cuba's past. We are its future. Lachaim. Gendan, salute. Just like your brother. He's smart. Alright, so we're in Cuba during like the 1950s, so the Cuban Revolution is in progress, you know, with Castro as leader and all that kind of jazz, you know. Uh, so yeah, let's talk to Michael here. If you guys don't know any background of the Godfather game story, um, well, the game basically follows the movie. There's just a couple things that have been changed, like basic characters, um, but... The guy in the first game, we work for him. We're a completely new person. Our guy was not in the first game, but we work for the guy who was in the first game, Aldo Trapani. So, this is Michael. He's the Godfather. If you guys don't know that, so let's talk to him. What's on your mind, Dominic? How are you enjoying Cuba? It's great, Michael. I like the little things here. You know, nice change of pace from New York. That's good. When this deal is done, we're going to do great things in this country. Tomorrow's a new year, my friend. The start of a new future for the Corleone family. Salud. To the future. By the way, where did Aldo go? He went downstairs for the New Year's celebration. You should talk to him. Make sure everything is set for tomorrow's meeting. Alright, so... As I just mentioned, Aldo was the Your guy in the first the right game. Decision, I mean, yeah, Aldo was the character that you played in the first game, the main protagonist. A favor for me. So, let's go talk to him. Then America. Um, I cannot be spread too thin. Yeah, we go this way. Sorry, I've always found this part of the uh, game kind of confusing because it's very weird the way the stairs work. I'm sure most of you in the comments will say that looks completely fine stairs. It is very, it looks very strange to me. I'm gonna be honest with, uh, with you. All right, so all those down here, and here he is. Boss, you all right? Michael wanted me to make sure that everything's set for tomorrow's meeting. Don't worry about it, Dominic. It's taken care of. I'm just anxious to get back to New York. I don't like it here. I don't trust what the president says, you know, about the rebels. I just want to get out of here. See this thing here? There's also a, a, a chosen speech thing that you can do. So, uh, 
say... Uh... Come on, Aldo. You really think the Rebels are gonna be a problem? Yeah, I do. You know what I saw on my way over here? I saw a Rebel being arrested. And instead of being taken alive, he exploded a grenade hidden in his jacket. They can win. Look, boss. One man with one grenade is hardly gonna take down an army. I know. It's just I got a bad feeling being here. Look, I'll be better after tomorrow. Let's get this New Year stuff over with, finish the deal, and go back to New York. Michael, Fredo, the countdown's about to start. All good. Is everything set for tomorrow's meeting? Of course, Michael. Don't worry about a thing. All right, guys, I'm going to stop it here. This has been Canadian 69 Gamers, and I'll see you in the next part of The Godfather 2.